You're watching your local news leader. This is WCIA 3 News at 10. The victim that was um, responsive on the ground was later pronounced deceased. A central Illinois community shaken tonight after two teenagers were shot and one of them died. Thanks for joining us. I'm McLeod Hageman. Jessica has the night off. A teenager is dead and another is recovering after a shooting in Taylorville. It happened last night at the square. Police were responding to a call about a fight when shots were fired in that same location. 19 year old Richard Kleekamp was arrested and he's charged with murder and attempted murder with a firearm. WCI 3's Jamie Mays has that story. And we don't have gun violence here in Taylorville. We just don't. But Thursday night, shots were fired in Taylorville's downtown square, hurting two people. A 17-year-old was shot and killed, and an 18-year-old is recovering. I'm just praying for all the families involved and praying for our youth that they may find the uh, direction that they want to go in, and uh, hopefully the, our youth will stand up and uh, get rid of the gun violence in our town. Police say they were responding to a fight when they got a call about shots fired. The suspect was not involved in the fight. He was driving by when the fight was happening, and then he must have known some of the people involved with the fight and then got out and then he shot twice. When an officer got to the scene, they found one victim on the ground unresponsive. They later found another teenager who had been shot in the arm. We were able to um, collect a lot of information in a very quick time. Um, there was video, there was eyewitnesses, and we were able to obtain a possible suspect within minutes upon arrival. They arrested the suspect, 19-year-old Richard Kleekamp. Leaders say incidents like this don't happen often in the city, and they're taking steps to make sure the community stays safe. I'm very concerned about it, and I will make sure that our square is patrolled extra this weekend and probably all summer long. Uh, we want the kids to be able to enjoy our courthouse and our square and uh, the businesses up there deserve it and we will make sure that it is safe. In Taylorville, Jamie Mays, WCIA 3, your local news leader. And the police chief says they are not too concerned about retaliation since that incident was isolated, but they also have help from the Illinois State Police this weekend to make sure the community remains safe.